VGC lore. In 2016, during Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, the official VGC rules allowed for every team to have two restricted legendary Pokemon, as well as allow for one Pokemon to Mega Evolve. Primal Groudon and Kyogre rose to prominence during this metagame as they not only had oppressive weather conditions that were in effect for the entire time they were present on the field, but because they were effectively a second Mega Evolution, bypassing this restriction due to the fact that they were technically called Primal Reversions. The only major difference between these two mechanics being the fact that Primal Reversions took place the moment Groudon or Kyogre hit the field if they had their respective orbs, while Mega Evolutions could be done at the start of any turn in the game. Primal Groudon at one point held such a strong hold of the metagame that some players, in an attempt to guarantee the outspeed in the mirror match under Trick Room, started to run level 49 Primal Groudon, since Primal Groudon's minimum speed at level 50 is 85, and at level 49 it's 83. Unlike today's VGC rules, Pokemon in this era did not automatically get leveled up to 50 in battles, so this was technically an option for every Pokemon. But it wasn't common due to the fact that sacrificing even a single level's worth of bulk or power would put you at a major disadvantage in most situations. Primal Groudon's insanely high stats made this negligible enough that even at level 49, it could two-shot opposing Primal Groudon with Precipice Blades while still being two-shot itself. This means that in a vacuum, if two Primal Groudon are in Trick Room, the slower one should win every single time, barring any crits. While it didn't see a large amount of play due to the fact that it was still risky, it is still noticeable enough to give a mention after all these years.